Well, it's been a while since Central Arkansas has last seen rain, making all of October so far a completely dry month, and many counties across the state are enforcing burn bans because of it. Good evening, everyone. Thanks for watching Carricket 4 News at 10. I'm Gary Burton Jr. And I'm Jessica Rank. Not only is this lack of rain causing burn bans to be enforced, but it's also affecting the upcoming duck season, which is approaching at the end of next month. We want to send things over to Catherine Thornberry, who joins us in the studio tonight. Catherine, you talked to a duck hunter today, so talk us a little bit about how bad those conditions are right now. Jessica, they're looking up pretty bad. I mean, I got to see I got to go out and see firsthand just how dry these duck holes are. And now you can take a look for yourself. With duck season approaching, hunters across the state are gearing up. But where ducks would usually flock to is now dry. Without rain, we'll be won't be able to hold the magnitude of ducks that we typically do. Um, you're going to have dry fields, uh, less food less habitat. Like many in the state, Bo Bradford has been duck hunting since he was a kid. Arkansas has always been known as one of the duck hunting capitals of the world. Um, and you have, you know, people that come from all over the United States to hunt here. But leading up to this season, he says the lack of rain will make for a poor outcome. I do think that uh, there will be a lot less ducks killed in the state than there typically are if we don't get some rain and get rain soon. He says despite the dry conditions, there are still ways to duck hunt, like on rivers and there will be hunters participating this season, rain or shine. Uh, every day that you get up and there's no rain with duck season creeping up, I mean, it's going to start November 23rd. And as of now, I mean, there's, there's nothing to look forward to. Bradford told me that where he hunts, it would take several inches of rain to revive that dry land, but he will be out there come the end of this month. Reporting live from the studio, I'm Catherine Thornberry. Back to you.